Well, good morning, peace. I know I'm not supposed to be on my phone while I'm driving, but I got the phone out of my hands and uh, I'm heading out on a couple errands. And I'm thinking of ways we could be praying for our community, right? Because um, a lot of things are changing right now. And so one of the things we can do is I think pray for pray for those people we know that run small businesses. I just I just uh, came from the only 7-Eleven in Idaho, which is right here in our lovely town of Post Falls, right next door to the Paul Bunyan. Um, and uh, people like that are are, um, are a little bit nervous. Uh, Munish, pray for Munish and his his family, uh, as uh, it sounds like he's he's very concerned about uh, where things are headed and as far as his, the store and maybe having to close down at some point and and just a lot of people on edge like that and so we again we have that opportunity to pray for them and to speak peace into their lives and, and let them know we're going to be praying for them and uh, I'm going to be coming and get my cup of coffee from him instead of from one of the more uh, expensive places right now and uh, just just continue to encourage him and so I wonder what ways God might have you connect with somebody like that this week uh, to get to to encourage them and speak uh, hope into their life in the midst of this right now and do some practical things for them. So, uh, gosh, I'm glad to be a part of a group like Peace Lutheran and and people with big hearts and and and, and gosh, prayer warriors. So, get out there and pray today. And uh, a reminder too that this Sunday is uh, the National Day of of prayer called by our own uh, Lutheran congregations and Mission for Christ, a day of prayer and fasting. And uh, we sent out a little post about that and we'll send out some more information this afternoon and also a link to our Sunday service. So uh, love you guys and um, can't wait to get to see you again and connect with you in some different ways. So have a great morning and talk to you later.